Nollywood movie producer Adam Ma look of the Junior Pope tragedy clears the air. She said, I have paid for all the calls to take the members' loss to their families. Please, I am also a human. She went ahead to say each crew member's family received an agreed amount and some decided to have their loved ones buried by the waterside as they believed that those who die by drowning should be laid to rest near water. This ritual involved invoking the spirit into a casket lined with a plantain leaf which was then sent to the family for burial. I have video evidence of their agreement of this arrangement hi guys welcome or welcome back again to the channel how are you all doing if you're meeting me for the first time nice to meet you my name is chin amso short for namso's world so in today's video i would like you to watch this video to the end but before we do that remember to click on the like button to like this video share this video if you can and subscribe to the channel subscribe and turn on my post notification bell so that each time there's a new video in this channel you'll not be left out to be notified to come and watch i appreciate each and every one of you who have subscribed to this channel and who are my real OGs in this channel. Thank you so much. I do not take you all for granted. So guys, today's video, just like I said earlier, please watch this video till the end. There is something Adam Maluk has to say. But before we do that, recently she compensated the four families that their family members demise with JP of which she paid a huge amount of money including the that took them to the mortuary a lot of things which she covered and she came with her proofs of which I'm going to be showing you the proofs of all the things she sent and the things she paid for meanwhile remember to watch this video to the end so that most of you who have not had or who might have not had her video of what she said because she said on her own it, it was not on her own to add a jp to her movie crew it was actually the wife who suggested that for her and she decided to to look into it and so sad it has to that way so she said something of which i will leave you to watch this video to the end on the 10th of april we lost five of our members who were on their way to work on their way to location through the means of both transportation had an accident I've been so traumatized. I've been so cold. This whole thing it still feels like a dream to me. Like I just wish I can still wake up from this dream. I've not been able to make any statements since because we've been trying to recover the bodies. I've been providing uh, providing for money to those looking for bodies. Provided uh, caskets, ambulance to make sure the bodies were conveyed to their villages to the families that wanted it to be done I've not been quiet I've been doing this I've been doing this just so these people can rest It's so sad that this had to happen on my set. It's so sad. I blame myself that I would have been in Lagos doing my thing in Lagos. I blame myself for coming down 
to a seven. I was supposed to be on that boat. My production manager was calling me to bring the memory card so they can start filming. And I told him to come and collect it. He said, Mama, you know this place is far. Please just bring it for us. I said, okay, why haven't you crossed? Why haven't you gone to work? He said, they're waiting for junior book to arrive. I said, okay. Before now, on the night, they went there on their own. When Junior Pool came, he came on his own. He came alone. So, on this tent, while I was getting ready to go drop the card with them, I was accompanying with my brother's children, two kids that were supposed to go with me. We were supposed to be on that boat together. Getting there, I saw Emeka. Emeka was my DOP. He was just sitting. I was surprised because I didn't see others. I asked him, what is it? And people surrounded him. I said, Emeka, what is it? Emeka was quiet. Emeka, it was the problem. Why haven't you crossed? Where is Ogolo? Where is everybody? Has JP come? He was quiet. I started shouting, what's happening? Somebody talked to me. I make an announcement. said, JP, don't go. Abigail, don't go. Friday, don't go. All of them, don't go. Precious, don't go. Ha. I still don't understand what he meant by that. I said, what do you mean, don't go? Don't go where? Don't go where? Like, they are not shooting again. He said, they didn't say water. They didn't say water. I said, no. Let me go. Let me go and look for them. They started holding me. They started holding me that she don't go. I said, let me go. Let me be there. Let me be sure the divers are looking for them. They said no, that there are over 50 divers inside the water looking for them. Hi, God. I still can't believe this. I still can't believe this because these crew members were my family. They've been working with me in Lagos. If I'm shooting in Lagos, they will transport from Asaba to Lagos to come and work with me. All through last year, we stayed together in Lagos. We were filming, working together. This is my first time working with JP. It's my first time filming with JP. He's my friend. The wife is my friend too. I talked to the wife sometime. And that was when she gave JP the phone and said, Why aren't you giving my husband work? If he said that you'd be my friend, why you not they give me work? I told JP that. You know you, my action video shoots. I hardly do action. 
He said, no, say they do love story or they do other things. That's why he's an artist now. He said, yeah, that's true. That I forgot that as an artist, you can do other things. So here is the recent poll she did. She said, it has become necessary for me to make a statement because of the false allegations being made against me. Since the tragic loss of Junior Pope, Abigail, Precious, Friday and Olanti, my team and I have been actively collaborating with the families to provide all necessary funds as requested from the degree grave diggers to the divers and fuel for the police officers involved in the search for the bodies this also includes expenses for casket ambulance and additional funds to cover other related costs she went ahead to update additionally my team and i arranged the departure of the ambulance from asaba to the homes of freshers and friday as a result of this, my team and I will be sharing details and video proofs of everything that has happened since this tragedy. In the time of a huge loss and mourning for these families, the allegations that I have not taken any action are complete lies. My team and I will remain in communication with the police and members of the families who have lost their loved ones. So guys, thank you so much for watching this video till this minute. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. Just like I said, remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe to this channel. Subscribe and turn on our post notification bell so that each time there's an update of this in my channel, you will not be left out to be notified to come and watch. I appreciate each and every one of you and I hope to be seeing you all again in my next video. Thanks and bye guys.